It's time for Buffed, Beautiful, and Bitchin', the at-home workout with Vera DeMilo. Hi, I'm Vera DeMilo, and thanks for tuning in. You know, before I learned how to exercise properly, I was a poor excuse for a woman. Just look at those unsightly lumps of lard protruding from my sternum. I was so weak and frail back then, I couldn't even tear a telephone book in half. But I made that change, and you can too. So let's get busy burning off those bothersome bazooms. <laughs> Girls, are you ready? All righty. Let's start with a stretch. And down. <laughs> okay, now you try. <laughs> See how those big breasts just weigh them down? I'm telling you, you can't float till you get rid of those sinkers. And now the shoulders. Come on, girls. Oh, yeah. That's right. Uh huh. That's right. Now this one. Just pull it and pull it. Really pull it. Oh, wow, that's going to be sore in the morning, but it hurts so good. And you know what they say, no pain, no gain. Now, before attempting any serious lifting, I can't stress enough the importance of eating a healthy breakfast. Of course, I prefer mine in concentrated form. <laughs> Another advantage of my at-home workout is that there's no need for investing in costly weight sets. With just a little imagination, a few hefty household appliances will do just as well. Right, Deidre, the secret to a strong, flat championship chest is breast bombardment with maximum weight. Are you ready? All righty. <laughs> That's the spirit. Show those memories no mercy. Hey, kids, it's time for Vera's vanity table. You know, some women spend a lot of money on lipsticks and glosses to make their lips look fuller. I say you can get the same effect naturally with a nice hot curling iron. Watch. Of course, it helps to have a high pain threshold. But believe me, when these babies start to blister, look out, Michelle Pfeiffer. Until next time, Teddy.